Hello. Hello. Come on in. Oh. Hello and welcome. Welcome, welcome. Hello. So today we bring you a new developer for Ooh. our channel. We are in a Taylor Wimpy home. We are in the Manford house type. And we are actually on a development that has pretty much sold out. Yeah. Um, so we're not going to be promoting this development, but we are promoting and showing you today this house type. So this house type is available across Taylor Wimpy's other developments, all links in the description as always. So have a look, we're in the hallway. Right, and everything is really nice and bright yeah, and let's open. Pop some lights on. Oh, there we go. There we go, that's better. Wow, look at the lights. Ooh, <laughs> I like them. I like them as well. They're kind of wavy, wavy. Wavy LED kind of lights. Right, let's start with this door. <clears throat> so we have, um, it was a two tone door, wasn't it? Mm, yes. yes. You've got like a dark on the outside and you've got white on the inside. Security features like the um, opaque glass. You have the peephole, the left box, the chain and the latch. The <laughs> security latch. latch. There we go. Right, so I'm standing, well, we are standing on a tiled floor. We are. This one's quite shiny. It is very shiny. Yeah, I mean, I imagine there's a full range of upgrades and choices. Yes. Um, just excuse that bag for a second. We have a mist. Ooh. ooh. Light switch. It's, Two tone light switch. Yeah, I, I imagine that's an upgrade. Yeah. And the door has some nice detailing in it as well. It does. What's in the mystery cupboard? Ooh, Ooh. there you go. So it's your fuse box and your internet. Yeah. There's also a plug in there as well. But it's quite nicely tidied away. Yeah. Ta-da. Yeah, that's quite nice, actually. That's handy. Have all of that. Yeah. Um, nicely tucked away. Right. I think we should just go... Straight into the living room. Living room? Yeah. With the glass door. Let's go. So I'm going to turn these lights on. I like the glass door. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, because when it's shut... You still get all the light. Yeah. We like that. We do. So... This Ooh, is a big living room. This is, this is huge. Yeah. So this is a four bedroom home. Um, and there is a, a, a big bay window. There is, lovely. Yeah, that's, that's great. They've got a two seater sofa in front of the bay. You could have whatever you wanted. Yeah. There is room for a three, three seater along the wall. And space for a massive TV. Mm, that's you huge. Could, you could have it wall mounted or, actually this is the right height. For, yeah. Sometimes units are quite high. And we're not very keen on televisions that are really high up on no. the wall because you're straining your neck. That's the perfect height. Is there a media point behind it? Yes. Hey. So all of your media uh, switches and plugs are all behind. So that's really good. Look at this. Wow. No, I've not seen a light like that before. Have you? No, it's very grand. Yeah. I um, love it. I love it too. There's also spotlights in the corners of the room. I imagine they're also... An what upgrade. lights? What lights? Down lights. Down light. This is this is a habit that's going to be hard to break. It is. <laughs> and again, the, the trend of hanging your curtains very high. Yeah. Uh, giving that hotel chic vibe, which we love. We do. I'm just going to test out these sofas. Ah, so. <laughs> uh, do you know what? These are comfy. Yeah. Kind of in the 1920s style, which is very in at the moment. I quite like these. Yeah. Massive poof. Massive poof. In the middle of the room. Yeah. We like these, don't we? We do. Shall we go through this massive yeah, doorway? I'm, I'm oh, lots of plugs. Oh, yes. Many, many plugs. plugs. And radiator behind. Wow. Mm. Okay, so okay. you've got double doors. Let me just... Let me hang on a minute. <laughs> it doesn't quite save the illusion because they're glass. <laughs> Hello. Hello. And welcome to the dining room. But it's nice to be able to yeah, set it off. It is. Wow. Okay. So you've got the, a kitchen that goes along the full length of the house. Oh, wow. I quite like having access from the living room because yeah. it opens it up into a big L shape. It does. Actually, a big U shape because you go through the kitchen door there as well. And you're back in the hallway. This is quite a nice um, party mm. house because imagine... It is. You could open the doors. You've got entertaining space here. You can even move the table further down. You can have everyone seeing. There's a good flow, I think, around the house. There is. I like this. It's lovely. Okay. So the doors here. French are doors. French with two panels. Overlooking the garden, of course. This is a show garden, as always, in the show homes. Um, so it comes as standard normally, but this is this has been done for the show home. But it yeah. shows what you can do, which is lovely. Space for a sofa over here. Yes. Behind, yeah. ta-da. But you could have whatever you wanted. Yeah. 
and they have a table place here. That's a nice space to have. It is, and then we've got quite a big kitchen. Are you ready for a rummage? I am ready. I am ready, I am ready. So, we have white units. These are gloss, and you've got the Zanussi fridge and freezer. freezer. Uh, we have a unit above. Ooh, there we go. Put all bits and bobs. We have a Zanussi double uh, oven, grill oven, oven grill. Now that's that, that's a grill. Now we have a fan assisted oven here. You have a very handy cupboard there. Yeah. Okay. Looks like a. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. A nice pull out larder. larder. I like. It. I also like the hooks. You can you can, you can hang things. Yeah. <laughs> if you wanted to. There's a, a really good, useful little nook Ooh, area. That's handy. Yeah. I think microwave would be good there. Yeah. Or a um, bowl of fruit. <laughs> anything, really. So you've got two cupboards. Two cupboards. You have... Ooh, that's quite... That's the extractor oh, fan. That's the extractor fan. Yeah, a strength there. We have a Zanussi induction hob. Yeah. A cutlery tray. Yeah. Pan drawer. Yeah, pan drawers. Plenty of work surface space. Oh, now Ooh. we like these. We do, we love the pull out couple these of things. These are the, yeah. We haven't seen these for a while, actually. No, they still spark joy. Yeah, they do. <laughs> We're having them in our own. But they're really good to be able to get to the far recesses of the cupboard. Yeah. There we go. And must be boiler. Must imagine. be boiler, yes. yeah. Boiler. Ideal logic boiler. Again, plenty of space for appliances, kettle, tea, coffee ma making facilities. Uh, under sink cupboard. So I would imagine this is the standard worktop. Yeah. It looks like a laminate with a stainless steel sink and a half. Um, dishwasher? Yeah. Yeah. So it's a Zanussi dishwasher. And we have another cupboard. Good. And I'm guessing just another cupboard on the I end. I would imagine another cupboard. But that's a perfect space to have a wine cooler. Yeah. Now, what do you think about this kitchen? I really like it. It's big, it's light, it's airy. There's plenty of workspace. Yeah. You can't go wrong. No, I like it. And like I said, the flow is good. So we're going to yeah. come, again, you've got the glass door. And back there, round. There is space for, for pet food as well. There is. If you do have pets. Um, so we're back in the hallway. There is a cupboard. Cupboard under the stairs. Yeah, which goes all the way to the to the bottom of the stairs. So Perfect. Useful for shoes. We have another door. Ooh. What do you think's behind this one? It's got to be a toilet. Oh! It's a utility toilet. Utility <laughs> toilet. Okay, so they've combined. Actually, to be fair, I would much rather it was this than just a big massive toilet. Yeah. We have seen some houses where. They have it's, massive. It's been about this size and they've got just a massive toilet. Yeah. And I quite like the fact that you've got utility space. So you've got Twyford um, sanitary wire, space for a washer dryer. We've got cupboards underneath. Perfect. Um, and a kind of shelf area here. Yeah, so that's perfect for yeah. like bleach and toilet rolls. I mean, in time, I don't know if it is an optimal extra. Do, by the way, do check with your sales rep, with your Taylor Wimpy sales rep, for all the extras. But even if it's not an extra from the developer, you could put cupboards across here as well. You could. To give extra storage. And there is also space against this wall for coats as there well. Is. Um, so I think this is and a, a towel rail. Handy. Yeah, and these, these are quite wide doors as well. It is. To be quite honest. Okay. I like this. We still have another room to check out down here. There's another nook as well. Oh, is there? <laughs> Under the stairs. Oh, look at that. That's handy. <laughs> yeah. That'd be good for a pet bed. Actually, it would, wouldn't it? Yeah. We have another room. We have a study. Oh, a bonus room. We have a nice little working from home space. Yeah, no, this is ideal. It is. So many of us are working from home these days, or you may have ch kids that need a study room, younger children that need a playroom. This, this is, is it. it. <laughs> Absolutely. So I like this space. Yeah. Um, quite a deep, deep window as well. Um, and in this house's instance, it's overlooking some nice shrubbery and trees. Oh, lovely. Um, yeah. Yeah, oh, perfect. and yes, I would I would definitely love to go to Miami. Yes. <laughs> or Hong Kong. Or Hong Kong, please. Uh, and this is a really useful... This area is carpeted as well, by the way. Yeah. Okay, shall we go... Up the stairs. Upstairs. Is there a light? There is. There we go. Right, let's go up. 
Mm, nice oh, it's here. lovely and warm up here. Yeah. Which way should we go? Should, let's just go. Yeah, left. let's just go left. <laughs> Always oh, left. Wallpaper. This is interesting. Mm. I quite like it. Right. Okay, we're into what I think might be the master bedroom. Yeah. So I can see a door that might be an ensuite. <laughs> so we've got a double bed here. Um, I think you could get a king size. In. You could. And you have some wardrobe. Now, you again, do. I would imagine these are the extras, and there's probably a choice of different doors. Yeah. So you've got rail with space above. And on the other side as well, I would imagine it's the same. Yes, it is. Yes. What do you think about this wallpaper? I love it. I it's love a pattern wallpaper. Textured. Ooh. Um, ooh, very kind of shiny cushion. Plump. They are very plump, I like them. And then the headboard. There is a dressing area as well. Perfect space for a glam yeah, station. I like the little stool. Yeah. <laughs> That's really cute. Right. En suite? Yeah, let's go in here. So, we have... We have a rainfall shower. Yeah, with a light above. Now, don't quote me, but these look like porcelain tiles. I think we've seen these before. Yeah. Um, I mean, yes, there's a rainfall. Ooh. We do always spark joy when we see a rainfall. We do. Towel rail here in a quite a nice handy little spot. Yeah. There is, uh, again, twice with sanitary wear, a window for ventilation. But there's also a vent above as well. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lot bigger than a lot of en-suites that we've seen. Yeah, let's just check the glide. Yeah, it's a Roman shower. Mm. Enclosure. Okay. Low profile as well. Perfect. Let's head on. Ooh, okay, so we're going to go out and we're going to turn left again. Yeah. We have a cupboard. We do. Uh, big water tank. Yeah, and but there is a nice handy shelf put in as well. There so is. You, you can use that for... Um, it's basically an airing cupboard. Yeah. There's lots of... Warm air coming out. Coming out. Perfect. Right. right. Next bedroom. Yeah. Ta-da. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Oh, wow. So, in this... Now, I, I don't know if this is an extra or not, but uh, for the show home, at least, they've, they've shown what you can do with this recess. So, could also be a wardrobe. Yeah. But they've got it as a glam station. And a this, proper glam station. Oh, look at this chair. It's like one of those um, classic ones. So, yes, there is... You can do your rouge. What's an outfit without rouge? Yes. Yeah, so you've got all of your your makeup palettes and everything. Different shades of lippy. Ah, I'm living, laughing, loving. <laughs> ah, the full-length mirror. I mean, who wouldn't want more? I like this. This is handy. Oh, you're thinking about for our house now, aren't yes. you? Yes. I mean, never mind the wardrobe. I just like sitting at... <laughs> this is lovely. Right. <laughs> the rest of the room is... Okay, this is very Instagram girl, isn't it? It is. It's very vlogger girl. It is vlogger girl. Um, but the fundamentals, you can get a double bed, possibly a king size. In. Yeah. Um, this could also be a working from home space as well, if you needed it to be. Yeah. Yeah, I like this space. It's very calming. It is. Yeah. Right, moving on. Okay, let's go left. Bathroom. Main bathroom. So it's um, got a... So this is the main family bathroom. Yeah, there is a shower over the back. I don't know if that's an optional extra. Tiling as well. Some, sometimes full height tiling is an extra. So do check. Um, I quite like the way it's finished off. Yeah, with the edging. Yeah, because not everyone does that. No. And I do like the attention to detail. Again, it's all Twyford sanitary wear, it seems, in this house. I like the little pulling out mirror. Oh, that's handy. That is handy. Ooh, I don't think we want it in ten times magnification. <laughs> Definitely not. We'll, we'll skip the ten times. <laughs> but no, I do like this. Yeah. Yeah, and there is space. You could put a laundry basket there as well. Um, yeah. Perfect. Quite nice, calming colours. So yeah, far, very neutral. Well. So just having a look down the stairs. Get a lovely I do always like view. the stairs view. See, I always like like a mirror above the stairs. Yeah, I mean, that would or a be, mural. You could check yourself before you come out every day. Right. Come in. Is there a light switch? Yes. There we go. Oh, oh, it's a princess room. It's a princess. Oh, look. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. I think our cats need one of these. They do. Look at it. There's a, there's a, a teddy rabbit in it. Oh, is that? It's a rabbit. It's a little rabbit. Yeah. Oh. Look. Okay, so this must be third bedroom. Third bedroom, yeah. I would say third bedroom. There's also a nice, like, detailing stripe. Oh, I like that. Uh, and a reading corner. Um, 
But let's not get too hung up on the really cute decor because <laughs> this room can be anything. Yeah. Um, and I also think you probably... Could you get a double bed in? I think you could if you lined it up against this wall. I'm not sure. We, you'd have to check dimensions, but... This could also be a perfect, just a wardrobe room. Yeah. Because you could have the rails going all the way down, and there's also space across here as well. So I think this could be um, a really nice space for whatever you want it to be. Yeah. But the decor in here is really, really cute. It is. I mean, look at this. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> it's a bunny. Uh, right, I like this. This is really nice. The carpet's very neutral as well. Hmm. Okay. Oh, hang on, you've missed a loft hatch. Oh, we missed a loft hatch? There's a loft hatch as well. And it's quite a good place as well. Last bedroom. Ooh. Yeah, first of all, can we just talk about the view onto a lovely night? It's like little village green kind of thing. Yeah, that's quite nice. That's lovely. And then, bam. Yeah, so I would say this is the second bedroom. Yes. Um, and it, it's definitely big enough for a king size bed. Um, Definitely. Again, With fitted wardrobes. Yeah, examples of the wardrobes. Um, okay. Plenty of storage. Yeah, space for a dresser as well. Yeah. Yeah, and of course, if you didn't want the upgrade, you could just have your own freestanding furniture. What do you think of the colours in here? Cause it's, it's, it's darker also, in here. It's darker in here, but it's still very neutral. It's very calming. Yeah. yeah. I think in terms of the interior decor, they've gone bolder in this room. Yes. I think all the rest of the house has been quite neutral. This is Have you noticed, though, in every show home we've ever done, there's always one bedroom where the interior designer gets to go, let's do something different! Yes, yeah, absolutely. I mean, we've seen lots of riding crops and horse yeah. paraphernalia recently. Um, but no, this, this is, I think, it's kind of like an opulent, um, a bit more, it is definitely hotel chic. It is. I think. And also, I like the two-tone of the curtain. Mm. Oh, yeah, well. that's nice which is quite a nice detail. Mm. Right, so we have toured... The whole house. four-bedroom Manford by Taylor Wimpy. Shall we choose our favourite room to do our outro? Let's go. Okay, so we have chosen... The living room. I think we've chosen this because... It, it's just big. It's big, it's, it's huge. It's big, and it's got easy access to the kitchen yeah. straight through. Yeah, so this room also kind of represents the flow. Yeah. I really like that the fact that you've got the double doors yeah. in between the kitchen... And then you could literally walk around. I mean, you can imagine kids just kind of running around. Running around in a loop. <laughs> or animals. Animals might do that as well. Yeah. Um, but no, I really love the flow of the house. It's got Me a too. good, open, airy feel. There's a nice width to this lounge, yeah. which I really like. The bay window as well. Um, it's got four bedrooms. It's got a nice and suite. It's got a downstairs toilet with a utility. Yeah, I it's think that a was study. a really clever use of yeah. space to do to put the toilet and the utility yeah. together. Um, the study, as you mentioned, was a really kind of a, a bonus room. A bonus room. Yeah, and there is a single garage as well, I do believe, there is, that yes. comes with this house. So if you've got this far in the video, there will be full room dimensions and floor plans at the very, very end. So keep watching. Uh, also, also, as I mentioned, this particular development is sold, um, but this house type is widely available across Taylor Wimpy's development. So we will put full links in the description box below. If you have a show home or a home that you'd like us to tour, then contact us on our contact email in the description box below. If you've liked the video, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the bell and the subscribe button so you get notified of all future videos from us. <laughs> to you all, and goodbye. Bye.